we're at uh, Hondaya, which is the pro version of the Joyful Honda store. What's nice about this particular shop is you can see all of the power tools and it's all lined up in a row from the different brands, Makita, Hitachi, uh, Ryobi. And um, you can touch and feel every single one of them. And I don't think you can use them, but you can uh, definitely check them out. Also, what's nice about this store, it's meant for pros, meaning it's uh, the higher end versions of all the tools. So you won't find the cheaper knockoff versions that you'll find at the other home centers. So let's go inside and let's check this place out because it's a lot of fun. So this store is not that big, but right when you walk in, you'll notice that there's a big difference. There's a lot more professional level tools here and everything's super organized. And you get so much selection when it comes to, you know, tape measures, uh, razor blades, scissors, cutters, screwdrivers. They even have uh, professional level uh, uh, power tools in a different aisle. But here in front of us, you can see, you know, all the different tape measures, you can see scissors, high carbon stainless steel. These scissors are incredibly sharp. They're all made in Japan. There's a ton of selection when it comes to socket wrenches. You can get different types of sockets, different sizes, different material types, screwdrivers, different types of bits, different types of screwdriver heads, Torx, you can do Phillips head, flat head. You have also the air tool section here. All these uh, tools, there you can check them out, see which ones you like. What's nice is they're all in one spot. This is all the air tools. You can see all the compressors down the bottom. This, is all... this section is all Hitachi tools. Uh, Hitachi changed your name to Hikoki. Uh, you'll see a lot of corded and cordless tools available here. On the other side of the aisle, you'll also see Kyocera, you'll see uh, Ryobi. This aisle is nothing but Makita tools, corded and cordless tools, different voltages. This one's really nice, this soft impact. The soft impact allows you to actually slow down the impact or make it a little bit gentler when you're actually driving in screws which is nice and convenient when you're going through drywall or something like this. This Japanese handsaw is really nice. This is the one that I keep on my belt um, when I'm working, but it's 200 millimeters is the blade length and it also folds, so it's really nice. And what's nice about this particular saw is it has two positions. This is a straight position, so if you're cutting something, and it's got a long handle, right, so you can, um, really cool really well on this but it also has this other position where it goes up one more so it's more in an angle so if you're trying to cut something really close to a wall you won't hit your knuckles so it's really nice this one. it's called zet saw i'll put information in the uh, description about this one this is really nice These are, I like this because it defines on the back, like, if you're trying to cut, uh, well, it's in English, first of all, quality label, it says piano wire, 2.5 diameter, steel wire, 4.0 di diameter, copper wire, 5.0 diameter, and this is all in millimeters. So it can cut some pretty thick material, but I've been flipping all these around just to see which one. There's so many. Yeah, you gotta flip it over. This seems to be the strongest one. Like this one's forty-eight dollars. So this one's about the same. These are nice because they're um, they're meant for a six millimeter uh, drill bit head, so you can actually hang this off of your waist and have a bunch of different uh, drill bits or even the Phillips head or a flathead screwdriver for your impact gun. And uh, they're just quick releases. But this one is uh, the bronze, gold, and silver one. So, it's nice. 